What's up, everybody? It's your man, Jay Filk, from HowToMakeVerySickBeats.com. If this is your first time, welcome. And today we have a quick tip for you guys with hi-hats. So let's get into it. <laughs> Question of the day. Name the best record of 2017 so far in your opinion. I'm curious. Whatever style, whatever genre. Okay, let's get right into this. This is going to be a quick tutorial dealing with hi-hats. And basically, we're using paradiddles. Now, before, I talked about double strokes. This time, paradiddles. And this is something that a lot of drummers use. And we're going to apply it to hi-hats. But it doesn't have to be strictly to hi-hats. It could be to toms. It could be to snares. Any percussion. It could be to samples. I don't care. <laughs> but today, we're talking about hi-hats. So here's the thing. The formula is right, left, right, right, left, right, left, left. Now, there's tons of different rudiments you can use. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you all something. This might help. You know, this You might be looking at this. What, what, what is Phil talking about? <laughs> okay. I got two rows, right? Okay. Right, left, right, right, left, right, left, left. Now, sorry, as I hit the microphone, sorry. Okay, so the right, the R stands for right hand, left stands for left hand. Okay, so you see how I have two rows and these, these squares. Now, these squares are going to represent the pads. And matter of fact, let me take my marker because I want this to be as clear as possible. Right, left, right, right. I'm going to let this represent the top row. And then... This left, right, left, left, let that represent the bottom row. Excuse my handwriting. <laughs> All right, so what I mean by that, on the pads, I'm using pads one through four. I have a hi-hat sound, right? And I have in a 16 level velocity. That means from softest to loudest, right? But for now, I'm just going to use this bottom row. You can use whatever row that you want to, but I'm just, for this, for, for this video, I'm just using the bottom row. Okay, so right, left, right, right, I'm going to use this top section right here. Notice this first pad is blank, okay? And then I have left, right, right. So that means I'm only going to use these three pads, okay? So I'm going to do something like this. Right, left, right, right. Right, left, right, right, okay? See that? Left, right, right left right and right and i'm using this formula right left right right that's how i'm doing that okay and then the second see the second row notice how this one is blank so i'm not going to use this pad this is going to represent pad one two and three left left right so i would do left right left left okay left right left 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 right left 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 right left left okay let's go to the top row again i will go right left right right next row left right left left so let's start real slow and you just practice start slow right left right right left right left left And then as you get better, you speed it up. The reason why I have 16 levels is so it sounds like you have accents, just like a real drummer would play. And as you speed it up, you will really, really hear how realistic it sounds. I'm going to go ahead and record right in front of you guys. And notice I am not going to quantize. I'm just going to record it as like that. Now I'm going to play it back, and as I speed it up, this is at about 48 BPM, by the way. I've recorded it real slow. And now, let's speed it up and listen to the swing. Watch this. Hey. 
And you could always use different accents, by the way. So, it's up to you. Hi-hats. Fun with hi-hats. Yes. <laughs> Try it out. Peace. Positive energy. <laughs> so if you like this video, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Make sure you check out the links down below this video. And don't forget, new videos every Wednesday, every Saturday. Alright? Peace!